Born Eldrick Taunt Tiger Woods in Cypress, California, USA on the 30th of December 1975 under the zodiac sign of Capricorn. He is considered one of the best and so most famous professional golfers of all time who has won 15 professional major golf championships, 82 PGA Tour events, 41 on the European Tour, and 18 World Golf Championships to date, which is extremely impressive. Thanks to his accomplishments, Tiger Woods will be inducted into the World Golf Hall of Fame in 2021. The handsome golfer rightly bears the title of one of the hottest sportsmen in the world. His Sporting accomplishments, good-looking appearance, and charming personality have helped him to steal many women's hearts. Over the years, Tiger Woods has been in the spotlight not only because of his success achieved as a professional golfer, but also because of the romances with plenty of ladies. If you would like to hear more details about his past relationships, just keep listening till the end. Do you want to win any of these items on your screen? If so, make sure to watch the whole video, leave a like and comment a hidden message. And without being said, let's get ready to the video. Tiger Woods and Ellen Nordegren were recognized as one of the most famous couples of the sports world. She is known for being a Swedish model, the daughter of the journalist and writer Thomas Nordegren and social democratic politician Barbara Holmberg. The handsome golfer met the Swedish beauty during the 2001 British Open Championship at the time when she was serving as a nanny to the children of famous Swedish golfer Jesper Parnevik. Over the previous year, Tiger was begging Parnevik to arrange a meeting with her, but she was romantically involved with someone else. According to The Sun magazine, Parnovic's wife, Mia, said that at the time, Ellen had no interest in Tiger, and he was okay with that. There was a big line of single golfers wanting to meet her. They were gaga over her. Luckily for Woods, Ellen Nordegren eventually fell in love with him, and they started dating in 2002. After a year, the famous golfer popped the question in November 2003 during their vacation in the luxury Shamwari game reserve in South Africa. People magazine reported that he proposed to her during a sunset walk on November 25th, after which the couple spent the night under the stars in sleeping bags. On the 5th of October 2004, the couple took a step further, swearing everlasting love to each other at a lavish sunset wedding ceremony at the Sandy Lane Resort in Barbados, attended by 200 guests, including Bill Gates, Charles Barkley, Oprah Winfrey, and Michael Jordan to name a few. A source revealed to People Magazine that Tiger Woods didn't act like he was going to get married, since he was very relaxed, like this was any other day for him. It was reported that the wedding cost an impressive, or perhaps extortionate, $1.5 million. In his 2006 interview with the magazine, Woods admitted that the newlyweds would like to expand their family, saying, we we are definitely going to have kids soon. We certainly want to do it, but adding, I'd like to have a boy first, then a girl. I like the idea of a big brother taking care of his little sister. I want them to be close in age too. I want my kids to grow up close. By the end of the year, Woods announced via his official website that they were expecting their first child in the northern summer, writing, we couldn't be happier and our families are thrilled. I have always wanted to be a dad. On the 18th of June, 2007, Tiger Woods confirmed that Ellen gave birth to their daughter they named Sam Alexis. The proud dad writing, both Ellen and Sam are doing well and resting peacefully, adding, this is truly a special time in our lives. The couple welcomed their second child, a son they named Charlie Alex, on the 8th of February 2009. The famous golfer confirming the news to ESPN Magazine and saying that their daughter Sam is very excited to be a big sister and we feel truly blessed to have such a wonderful family. However, in November 2009, their marriage started to fall apart when the National Enquirer magazine reported an extramarital affair he had with New York nightclub manager Rachel Uchitel. Two days later, Tiger had a car accident, after which he was treated for minor facial lacerations. Ellen used a golf club to smash one of the car's windows, apparently to help her husband, which sparked speculations that she'd actually tried to attack him with it after she found out about his affair. According to USA Today magazine, he eventually denied it and wrote in a statement on his website that the situation was his fault and added, it's obviously embarrassing to my family and me. I'm human and I'm not perfect. I will certainly make sure this doesn't happen again. Moreover, he called the car accident a private matter and said that he wanted to keep it that way. Shortly afterwards, about 15 women went public, claiming through various publications to have had an affair with Tiger. According to the Sun Morning Herald magazine, incredibly, Woods confirmed the claims and tried to apologize to his wife Ellen and the children through a statement on his website one more time, writing, I have let my family down and I regret those transgressions with all of my heart. I have not been true to my values and the behavior my family deserves. I am not without faults and I am far short of perfect. Moreover, it was also reported that he confessed to having slept with 120 women during their marriage. In December 2009, Woods announced that he was going to take a break from tournaments because of his injuries from the accident and that he was also undergoing rehabilitation treatment for sex addiction. Following these revelations, many major companies ended their sponsorship deals with him. In February 2010, he made another public apology to his wife for cheating on her. According to BBC News Magazine, he said, I was unfaithful, I had affairs, and I cheated. What I did was unacceptable, and added, I knew my actions were wrong, but I convinced myself that normal rules didn't apply. I never thought about who I was hurting. Instead, I thought only about myself. I ran straight through the boundaries a married couple should live by. He also said, I felt that I had worked hard my entire life and deserved to enjoy all the temptations around me. I felt I was entitled, and thanks to my money and fame, I didn't have to go far to find them. I was wrong, and I was 
foolish. Tiger Woods and Ellen Nordegren divorced in August 2010. During the same month, she told People Magazine that she had been through hell since Tiger's infidelity surfaced, saying, it's hard to think that you have this life. And then all of a sudden, was it a lie? You're struggling because it wasn't real. But I survived. It was hard, but it didn't kill me. She also denied chasing him with a golf club, saying, the speculation that I would have used a golf club to hit him is just truly ridiculous. Ellen received around $110 million through the divorce settlement, with a source close to her revealing, she's feeling okay about all this. She's been through hell, but handled herself with such dignity, and now she's got a whole new life ahead of her. No matter what, they apparently remain on relatively good terms and share custody of their children. In her 2014 interview with People Magazine, Ellen said that she had moved on with her life, revealing that her relationship with Tiger is centered around their children, saying, we are doing really good. We really are, and I am so happy that is the case. He is a great father. The list of 120 women with whom Tiger Woods cheated during his five-year marriage to Ellen Nordegren includes such ladies as Los Angeles cocktail waitress Jamie Grubbs, who claimed that their affair lasted for 31 months, Las Vegas nightclub executive Kalika Moquin, who said that they hooked up several times in 2009, Orlando waitress Mindy Lawton, who claimed that they had a two-year affair, porn star Jocelyn James, who reportedly left her job during their relationship, which lasted for three years, escort Lordana Jolie, who slept with the professional golfer several times between 2006 and 2008, Orlando waitress Julie Postal, who had an encounter with Woods back in 2004, porn star Delon James, whose affair with Tiger lasted for two and a half years, and Woods neighbor Rachel Codriet, who slept with him only once. Following the cheating scandal and divorce from Ellen, Tiger Woods fell in love with Olympic gold medal skier Lindsey Vaughn. The two of them met at a charity event in Las Vegas in April 2012, but the rumors that they became a couple only started flying around in November that year, which she denied, claiming in her interview with the Denver Post magazine that they were nothing more than friends, saying, my brother was the ski instructor for his kids this November in Vail, guessing that's where it came from. The rumors continued to swirl, and several sources confirmed to Us Weekly magazine that Tiger and Lindsey's friendship slowly turned into a relationship by February 2013. A month later, it was reported that they spent the weekend on his luxury yacht privacy, and a few days later, the couple confirmed the relationship through separate statements. According to the magazine, Tiger wrote on his official Facebook page, Lindsay and I have been friends for some time, but over the last few months, we have become very close and are now dating. We want to continue our relationship privately as an ordinary couple and continue to compete as athletes. While Lindsay published on her Facebook page, I guess it wasn't a well-kept secret, but yes, I am dating Tiger Woods. During their relationship, they were spotted at each other's tournaments, and Lindsay even met his children. Perhaps unsurprisingly, things between Tiger and Lindsay turned sour, and in May 2015, they announced their split after three years of dating. She wrote in her Facebook statement, Tiger and I have mutually decided to end our relationship. I will always cherish the memories that we've created together. She cited their incredibly hectic lives as the main reason for their breakup and added, I will always admire and respect Tiger. He and his beautiful family will always hold a special place in my heart. Tiger Woods also confirmed the news about their split up on his website, writing that they mutually decided to stop dating and adding, I have great admiration, respect, and love for Lindsay and I'll always cherish our time together. Lindsay opened up about her feelings for Tiger in her November 20th 2015 interview with CNN Magazine. I mean, I loved him, and I still love him. I had an amazing three years with him. Sometimes things just don't work out, and unfortunately, it didn't work out for us. But I don't have any regrets, and I think we're both in a pretty good place. Following the split, they remain on good terms. Then, Tiger soon became romantically involved in a relationship with personal stylist Kristen Smith in November 2016. Little is known about them in public, since they kept it low profile. It's unknown when they actually called it quits. However, Tiger tweeted that they parted their ways by the end of 2016. It was later reported that Kristen was the one who ended their romance after she found out that he cheated on her with Erica Herman. A source close to the attractive blonde explained to Radar Online magazine that Kristen suspected it, but he would always deny it by belittling Erica, but adding, Kristen eventually caught them together. It was a big mess. The source also revealed that Tiger's jealousy was also a huge problem in their relationship and that there were fights where she thought he was cheating. That started about a year in, and then things went south. In April 2018, TMZ magazine reported that Tiger Woods offered Kristen money after the split to keep the cheating scandal a secret, which she allegedly accepted and signed a non disclosure agreement. Over time, things changed, and she tried to invalidate the agreement by claiming that it wasn't enforceable. Tiger threatened to release embarrassing pictures of her if she broke the deal, which eventually escalated into a legal battle. Shortly after his split from Kristen Smith, or perhaps during, the professional golfer started dating Erica Herman. According to Page Six magazine, Tiger met her at the Blue Martini in Orlando, Florida, where she was working as a bartender to get through college. She eventually started working as a general manager at his restaurant called the Wood Jupiter, so they crossed paths frequently. It's unknown whether he actually hired her or not. As time passed, the two of them became pretty close and eventually started their relationship. Their first public appearance as a couple was at the President's Cup in September 2017, when it was noticed that she was wearing a player spouse badge around her neck. During the same month, several sources close to Erica revealed to The Sun magazine that she had been chasing Tiger around like a puppy for close to 10 years, and one of them said, I'm not sure if his wife knew, but I'm not sure how she couldn't know. I can't believe Tiger is out in public with her now. Moreover, Radar Online magazine reported that she was labeled in her inner circle as a hard partying gold digger with a supposed troubled past. Just two days later, Later, Erica accompanied him to court, where he pleaded guilty to driving under the influence in May 2017. She has also supported him at various tournaments. Moreover, 
she became close to his kids, and they were spotted together multiple times. Recently, it was rumored that Tiger and Erica had ended their romance. According to Express Magazine, she denied those rumors and described their relationship as great. She then added, great with no end in sight. We hope so, but given his philandering history, nothing would really surprise us, would it? Thank you for spending some time with us. Make sure to like and subscribe so you never miss another video. We also handpick these videos which we recommend you watch next. You can talk to us on all social medias or ask a question in the comments below. Thank you for being with us and we'll see you back tomorrow.